Hey, what's going on, Flash Mob? It's your boy, Flash. I hope everybody's doing good and staying safe. I'm excited to share some information that I came across recently that's really gonna help you promote your business and increase your bookings. I'm gonna give you five reasons why I decided to get HoneyBook. Run the intro. Really quickly, guys, if this is your first time here, welcome. My channel is all about helping you turn your passion into a paycheck. And along the way, we're gonna grow a bit and learn together. So if that's the kind of thing that you're into, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and make sure you turn on notifications so you don't miss any future videos. So I do wanna mention this video is not sponsored. However, I am able to give you guys a 50% discount off of your first year of HoneyBook if you do decide to sign up. I'll make sure that I leave it in the description below. So let's talk about HoneyBook real quick. For me, one of the most difficult things for my business is staying organized. I'll get a new inquiry, I have to follow up and send out some emails, and along the way sometimes I get lost or maybe I'm not doing it as quickly as I should, and potentially I could be losing those clients. By having a really good CRM like HoneyBook, it's gonna ensure that you're always on top of your clients, whether that's bookings, follow-ups, getting paid, sending contracts, it doesn't matter. This helps you organize everything. So number one on the list is the contact forms. Contact forms are one of those things that really help you gather information about potential clients that are interested in using your services. The way that HoneyBook implements contact forms is they allow you to connect it directly to your website. And as soon as you get a new inquiry, they create a new contact in your pipeline and it allows you to follow up with those clients really easily. So a few things that I like to include in my contact form is the name, email address, a phone number, a projected start date, the type of service they're interested in, an estimated budget, how they heard of us, and then something that tells me a little bit about what they're actually trying to accomplish. So like I mentioned before, once a client fills out that contact form, HoneyBooks automatically creates a project for me where I can see all of that information that they filled out. And why I love it is because it makes it really easy for me as the vendor to pre-qualify that client and move over to the next step. So number two on the list is templates. So one of the things that I really dread doing as an entrepreneur is email. The reason why is because it's super redundant. I'll send the same exact message to 100 different people in a month, let's say, and I'm typing it over and over and over again. And on top of that, there's contracts, there's information about my packages and all these different things that I wanna to send to my clients that I'm doing so many times and it uses up so much of my personal time just trying to get my information out to clients. So a few of the things that HoneyBook allows you to template are emails, contracts, your packages, invoices, brochures, proposals, and things like questionnaires. Now, having the ability to have those all pre-made and available to be sent out to your clients at any given moment saves you a ton of time. And it just takes a lot of stress off of your mind and having to remember to do all these things or even just missing a step. So when I got started with HoneyBook, the first thing that I did was go in and start building my packages. So anything that I charge for, I created a package for. Then I went ahead and created a brochure and a proposal. So essentially what a brochure is, is a document that allows people to know a little bit more about your business, maybe about you personally, the services that you offer, and it makes it really easy for them to make a decision on if they wanna move forward with you or not. Then your proposals is where it really gets interesting because when you send out a proposal to a client, it allows them to view the services that they wanna take advantage of, the contract that you want them to sign, and it also shows them the payment structure. So one thing I'm gonna definitely be doing is sharing a lot more videos on each individual portion of what HoneyBook allows you to do. So if you wanna get more information on how brochures and proposals look and work and how to create them, make sure you stay tuned and subscribe so you see all the future videos. So number three on the list is integrating my calendar. So this might be one of those things that's overlooked quite a bit, but it's super powerful when you use it effectively. Let me tell you quickly how I used to do it before. So essentially I get an inquiry, somebody would wanna meet with me or have a call or whatever the case is. And we'll start going back and forth trying to figure out a time and date that works for both of our schedules. So I'll send them my availability, they'll come back and tell me what their availability is, and we'll try to figure out which one will work the best for everybody. And it was just a lot of unnecessary back and forth. With HoneyBook, it allows you to connect to Calendly, which is an online calendar service, which basically allows you to show people what your schedule is and create certain sessions that allow you to connect with your potential client. So for example, 
I usually do consultations, so I have a preloaded 30 minute consultation. A couple or client can go in there and see my availability, decide on a time and date that works best for them, and then it will automatically send them out a Zoom call. Then we can connect and do that together. It makes that first step of meeting a client so much easier. So number four is what HoneyBook calls the pipeline. So this part is what actually really sold me. And the reason why is because for me, one of the most difficult things again is to stay organized with all the different inquiries that I have coming in. And on top of that, all the bookings that I actually have. So what HoneyBook does is they create something that's called a pipeline. And essentially it helps take your clients from an inquiry all the way up to a completed project. Let me just show you really quickly what my pipeline looks like. So once somebody fills out my contact form, they automatically fall into my inquiries. From there, as soon as I talk to them or say anything or send any information, they move to that follow-up portion. After I followed up with them and I'm able to schedule a meeting, they automatically move over to the meeting portion. After my meetings, I usually send out a brochure and then on the brochure, they're able to select the services that speak best to them. And then from there, I go ahead and make a proposal for them. And proposals are cool because it allows you to see the packages and services that they like, as well as attach your contracts and a payment structure. And this is where it really gets good for me. So once they actually sign the proposal, it'll show up here. Once the first payment on the project is made, it moves over here. And then we start planning out the project. From there, we move over to the production portion of it where we actually go out and physically shoot. Then we finally fall into the completed portion of the pipeline. Now let's say I have six follow-ups and one of the people in here just don't respond to any information that I send them. I can just go ahead and move them over to the archive folder. So essentially in the archive folder, I don't really like to delete projects. I kind of just keep them there. And that just lets me know that these guys probably weren't that serious about using me. But if they ever do show up again, they do respond, I know where to find them. So again, guys, for me, this is one of the most important parts just because it, it puts every single one of my clients into a simple to follow workflow. And from there, no matter where they fall within the pipeline, I'm able to do what I got to do to try and push them along to get to that completed stage. So this section is actually gonna be a really big section that I talk about a lot in a future video. So make sure that you don't miss that one. So number five is getting paid. The ultimate goal of every entrepreneur or any business is to move a client from thinking about it to actually paying for it. So why would you make it difficult for them to do so? In HoneyBook, you're able to build an invoice and create a payment plan and use that over and over and over whenever you wanna send it out to a client. This takes a lot of unnecessary steps out of your workflow. And what makes it even easier for your clients is that it allows them to pay by either their bank account or a credit card, making it even that much easier for them to make a payment to you online. And on top of that, if it's a larger project that requires more payments, HoneyBook is gonna automatically send out payment reminders to your clients, letting them know when a balance is due. Then your money goes straight into your bank account that you connect with HoneyBook in three to five days. Amazing. So if you guys stuck around, I'm actually gonna give you a bonus reason. And the last one is automation. So let me tell you guys about the steps that happen automatically when a couple reaches out to me for their wedding. So first thing, they'll go ahead and fill out my contact form on my website. From there, they'll immediately get an email with an option for them to schedule a consultation. After we finish the consultation, I will automatically send out a brochure just summarizing everything that we talked about in the actual consultation. Couples are then able to select the package that they want. If they do select a package, then we move on to the next step where I send a proposal. If they don't, however, select a package right away, I send out three reminders, one five days, 10 days, and 14 days after our initial consultation. If they never go to my follow-ups, I'm gonna send them over to my archive file, but if they do, I'm gonna send them a proposal. In the proposal, it's gonna show them the package that they liked or any add-ons that they wanted, it's gonna connect them with my contract, and it's also gonna show them the exact payment structure that's required to book me. Once the client makes it all official, another email is sent out thanking them for choosing our team. Then another email is sent out letting them know how we can book their engagement session and start looking into potential dates for that. Then we actually send them out another questionnaire 30 days before the wedding. And on that question form, we ask things like who's the maid of honor and best man and their contact information, where's everybody getting ready in the morning, What's the shot combinations that you want? Things like that that just help us understand exactly what they need from us on the actual wedding day. Then boom, after the wedding, they get another email, just congratulating them again and letting them know the next steps and what we're gonna do for them. 
And then we send them out another questionnaire just asking them how we did, basically getting a review from them so that we can post on our website or anything like that. And then finally, we send out an email a year later congratulating them on their one year anniversary. And all of that is all done automatically. Of course, there might be a little bit of things that I do here and there, but the workflow is already set in place and I only have to do minor tweaks if needed. Now this happens automatically for each couple that enters our funnel. This takes a lot of brain power and actual work off of our shoulders because it's being done by the program. So this is really just an overview of the things that I really liked about HoneyBook. And I mean, if you guys are serious about trying to improve your workflow and automating and all those kind of things that just make your life that much easier, I would strongly recommend looking into HoneyBook. And for the people that are interested in moving forward, there is a 50% discount that will be applied to your first year at HoneyBook. I'll leave it in the description and you can go ahead and use my code and take advantage of that discount. Be sure to come back and watch the other videos where I go into detail about all the options and sections that HoneyBook offers so that you can be best informed on how to use the program. And for anybody else that may have any questions or you just want to start talking, go ahead and leave something in the comments below for me. But yeah, guys, thanks for sticking around. That's the end of this video. Always remember to look, learn, and share. Take it easy, guys. 